Man, I was glad to test out this brand new company, new to the scene. And just to let you know, it has an awesome feeling beard. And if you want awesome feeling beard, you're gonna go check this company out. And that company is Blue Collar Beardsman. So as usual, let's go get this review and get into that website. Talk about the scents, the prices, the greenses, and if I may or may not have any recommendations for it. So let's go check it out. All right, so here is his main page. So as you can see, he actually has a picture of his current scents right here. So he has six, actually five are scented and one unscented. And we'll talk about those scents. I do have uh, uh, five of those, uh, four scented and one unscented. All right, so there's the main page once over. And one thing I like to see on the, on the is that he's already got, being a brand new company, is a scent list. So under the learn tab, you got the scent list and the facts. Uh, their story, which is pretty cool read, so go check that out, and of course to contact us, but let's go ahead and click on that scent list. Now his scent list is a little bit different. I mean, he does have the, the scent profiles on here, but you know, as other companies may just do kind of a listing of it. But overall, this is pretty cool too. You have the picture and the name of the, the scent underneath it, then the scent profile listed out, and the uh, shop smoke break. You can just click on that button to click on that one so that's pretty cool so let's actually uh, go back to the uh, products tab up here and he has actually a limit the sparky the limited edition so let's click on that just kind of talk about that and the limited edition is a one-time purchase is going to be $24.99 but if you subscribe and for the uh, monthly cent basically it's monthly cents that you can get for $19.99 for those that are one ounce oils, and of course the limited scent uh, for this the month is going to be Sour Patch Kids, Fizzy Lemon Lime Soda, Peak Lemonade, and Fruit Punch, and hints of race fuel and leather. So that's definitely, definitely different. All right, so let's go back to products and go over each of these and talk about the scents and stuff. All right, the first one's going to be Barbershop, and as you can see, they are $19.99 for a one ounce oil, and the scent is right above right below that is classic crisp clean barbershop scent with a sweet powdery finish and overall that's what i get i definitely get that nice clean original barbershop type scent and that powdery finish and does get a little bit of sweetness to it for sure so definitely a powdery barbershop with a tiny bit of his, uh, sweetness i can pick up so overall that's pretty cool and if you scroll down a little further you do get a list of ingredients over here, which is ostrich oil, rice bran oil, broccoli seed oil, meadow foam seed oil, argan oil, jojoba oil, avocado oil, and skin safe fragrances for the uh, scent. Now for the ostrich oil, because I know a lot of guys like to wonder, you know, when it comes to bird oil, what percentage it is, and this is going to be 50% ostrich oil in his blend. All right, let's go back to the products. Talk about smoke break. So I actually see the profile, which is right above, right here above the, the uh, shop here is sweet and spicy Cuban tobacco, touch of pipe tobacco with a light French vanilla finish. Overall, I think this is actually blended pretty good. I mean, I can do get the uh, tobacco-ness from the, uh, the, the Cuban tobacco and pipe tobacco, and you do get like a little vanilla finish. So just a vanilla tobacco, which is really, really cool scent. Definitely enjoyed this one. And let's go back to the next. Actually, let's go to the scent list. It'd be a lot easier, wouldn't it? And the apprentice right above my head here is fizzy lemon lime soda with a hint of fruit crunch. So, you this is definitely a citrus scent, and this is a really cool scent. I do want to say this citrus scent actually lasts a long time for a citrus scent, and it actually pretty much lasts all day. I did a good whistle throughout the day, so it's actually pretty cool. Uh, the bit, but for the scent itself, you definitely get a lemon lime, and you do get that, I guess, kind of fizziness to it, definitely for sure. And then at the end of it, you get that kick of fruit punch. So nice scent there. And if I had to rank all these scents that I got, is this one was actually really my favorite one. So pretty cool. And the Bossman over here to the the far left over there is rich, warm, masculine complex cologne. And I, I can't really place it, but this seems familiar to me. Uh, but it is definitely a nice, warm, masculine type cologne. So um, I wish I could say more about it, but definitely, definitely uh, nice 
uh, cologne scent, so for sure. And th this is the one, the Rise and Grind. This is the one I didn't get because uh, he actually he actually does send these out to me for a review, and I just you know, I did mention that I don't like coffee scents, so he did not send me this one. And uh, but it's black coffee mixed with hints of creamer, caramel, and chocolate. So if I mean just by sounds of it, if you like the coffee scents, uh, this one actually sounds pretty good if you like coffee. So. And this other one here is Average Joe. Boring, just naturally fragrance. And what you get out here is definitely fragrance free. I couldn't really smell anything out of it. So definitely a true unscented. So yeah, so check it out. Awesome, uh, awesome scents there. Like I said, the Apprentice, which is the uh, fizzy lemon lime soda with a hint of fruit punch is kind of my favorite. And overall, I didn't really have any recommendations for the west side. They all look pretty cool. The pictures on the graphics and everything look cool. cool. You have a scent a list. The greens, the greens are clearly visible for you to see. Uh, so overall, west sides look pretty, really, really good for just starting out. So congrats. And I do know that he is actually going to be coming out with some butters. You know, just like I said, just you just saw the oils on his webpage, but he is going to be coming out with the oils and wash and conditioner soon. So that will be pretty good to see. All right, so when it comes to the film beard, this awesome, awesome, awesome film beard. Kept my beard nice and soft all day. I mean, really nice and soft. Definitely enjoyed it. I mean, it kept my beard just as soft as any butter was. So definitely really enjoyed this, uh, the film beard. And of course, you know, kept my skin nice and hydrated. Never even probably the beard itch or anything like that. So definitely, if you want to try this company out, I definitely would give it a shot. You know, go see what it's all about. Definitely, like I said, amazing feeling beard. So if you want to try it out, check out this website in the description below. Remember, keep your business status healthy. Till next video.